Okay, I'm back. So, uh, talking to answering Miss Crystal's answers, not bad. Uh, I think she's a single mother looking for my free implants. Not that it matters. Um, only to her. I mean, I have enough, um, you know, enough uh, uh, trouble as is. So, uh, I thought I would uh, answer uh, before I hit the sack um that i'm just following uh a lot of people who i've talked to and uh people online and offline who say it's basically you know in their eyes uh, a, a legal way of prostitution now uh when i looked at it that was my uh, opinion too but i was gonna try my best but right now i cannot do anything of the sort so the only thing I could say to the viewers, uh, Miss Crystal, is if they want to go try it, then I'll send them over to let them watch your video, and I am going to be going to uh, stay out of it because as a minister, I may not try anything like that because, well, frankly, it is, um, how would I say it, it is uh, not right for me as a minister now to try to uh do something like that on the sort so technically i would be stuck with uh doing uh something else so um like um um like doing it finding a way to pay for my uh implants for example so um Uh, sorry, I was reading my ministry message. So, what I meant to say is, is I will send them to you so you can straighten them out. I will cut off the subject of my free implants and I'll go back to doing my other videos of things of uh, transgendered issue and electronics for the most part. I was curious about breast implants and doing some research on YouTube because I have nothing better to do. At the moment, Miss Crystal, because frankly, I have, uh, as I said, I'm watching my mother die from uh, chronic obstructive pulmonary disorder, COPD, emphysema, and her kidneys are failing. So, I have to pass the time in between, and you know, the only way to do it right now, instead of playing my video games, is to... Um, use the internet and watch videos and check out what's available for different subjects so I can educate myself, enjoy a few laughs, and hope like heck I can um, get things done, you know? So, um, anyways, like I said, uh, no, no, uh, uh, what what's that word? I'm very tired, ma'am. So please excuse me. Um, no insults taken. That's what it was. I, I was just giving my experience of what happened with me. Okay, everyone's experience is a little different. I'm not going to give my experience again on my free implants because frankly, it is a dead subject, and you can't beat a proverbial horse dead when it's already dead. So technically. You know, you can't beat a dead horse when it's already dead. So, um, on top of that, I am real. I'm a person like you. I do bleed. Um, if I wasn't real, I wouldn't be here. Plain and simple. So, um, all I wanted to say was, there you go. Uh, there you go when it comes to um, the whole entire... Um, subject you know you can check it out uh leave a good topic you know of discussion but my experience was being who i am transsexual male to female i don't lie about it i don't deceit i mean the video let me put it to you this way the videos i made are a big series all right they're between six and eight minutes long and there's over ten of them that is a in memory of my mother of how many good times i've had with uh with her I had to do it tonight 
being strong because, well, when she does go, I want to post it all for YouTube and for the links to my Facebook account for, um, let me just say it, for my family. They all wanted me to make some videos, so I did of my memories since all my family's on Facebook. So, I didn't mean to be insulting. I'm just sharing my own experience. Your experience is different. My experience is mine. Yours is yours. We all have experiences. I mean, I was sharing some of the experiences in the videos, which I haven't uploaded. It's in a special folder right now of my um, uh, of memories of my mother. So, you know, so technically, you know, with all that, she being in a zombie comas toad state and being dehydrated, hospice is saying there's not much more time. So, bottom line is, yes, I am real. They did kick me out. It was because I'm not a genetic woman. But that's okay. I can live with it. But I do like to share my experience once in a while with the viewers. That's why I made that video. However, to be honest with you, my video was supposed to be 9 minutes long. And there was an upload problem. So it cut my video off midway. Unless there's a term for comments. Like 6 minutes or something. So, yeah, I wasn't done. So, technically, there you go. So, all in all, if you want to get yourself a breast job or a breast reduction or whatever, be my guest. I'm not going to hinder you. I'm just going to experience, uh, you know, I will give my experiences, I should say. I'm tired, really tired. Anyways, um, my experiences to the world, and they can make the judgment. My partner... They uh, was looking it over too, by the way, and they have their own thing. They were going to make their own video, but they don't want to do it because they don't have a good webcam. This computer here has got a great webcam, so, but I encouraged them not to, and I said I wasn't going to make a video, but I just came across it by uh, just looking up info to see if anyone else had to say anything about my free implants. So I decided, well, this one here had a good review. I'd post my own experience. That's all I was doing. So, and no, I didn't say, uh, well, I did say that um, a lot of them probably would sell their soul for a boob job, but I didn't really mean it in that way. I'm just saying um, there's a lot of them out there that want their breasts bigger, and they do anything pretty much for it except for murder. And I was just saying it in that way. I mean, it means the playing field is open, as a friend of mine would say. So, um, like I said, uh, no offense taken. I know you have your experiences. I have mine. So, um, it was just the way I, me and my partner were thinking. Um, you know, we were thinking, uh, you know, that both the same thing, same with friends of mine. I have a friend who runs, uh, works in a newspaper and did an article on my free implants, I think in the local rag. I'm not sure, but she was working on it. But basically the thing is, is everyone they talked to was the same. You know, it was legalized prostitution is how things look at it. You sell your pics, you do this, you do that for, you know, you know you'd have to work probably hundreds of hours to get your breast implants so I have my own ways of getting mine so I, I don't have to worry there so um, but anyways more power to you um, I should make this done something else I was going to say but you know the time ticking if I can remember I can remember otherwise it'll just be a two parter um, I do want to get some sleep so it is late so alright so if I remember I remember otherwise Peace. No, uh, no uh, insults taken.